guys are doing? Good. Lovely. Did you Mighty. have a good day? Dirty. You're dirty. dirty. <laughs> you deserve a shower. <laughs> yes, tired, exhausted, tired. but having a great time. Very Any great so. words of wisdom? Don't fall and hit your head in a mud bog in Vermont. Uh, it's not good. Not Enjoy good showers and electricity while you have it. Yes. <laughs> Hike smart. Wet wipes. Wet wipes. Baby wipes. <laughs> How about One. insect repellent? No. Uh, it doesn't work. <laughs> got evil blood. All natural like doesn't work. <laughs> started last year or what Sean and Mark started last year with uh, Warrior Hike. When they came back from Afghanistan, they decided they were going to walk the trail and realized along the way that it was an amazing way to calm, calm, calm their minds and to uh, just Get rid of the stuff, as Earl Schaefer said. Walk off the sights, sounds, and losses of the war. We're doing this not only for ourselves, but we have young men, young women, and some older ones um, com coming back from Afghanistan, coming back from Iraq, that have seen things that you know some of us understand and some of us don't. And this is just a amazing opportunity to support for us to support those guys and we obviously cannot do it without the VFWs, the auxiliaries, the American Legions, the Marine Corps Leagues and every individual here in this room that has supported us, liked our Facebook page, given us rides, you know, everything, cooked us dinner, everything and we cannot do it without all of you so for us we say thank you and thank you. Um, my name is kevin reed i currently live in rochester minnesota i grew up in southeast florida i served in the united states marine corps from 1989 <laughs> to, from 1989 to 1983 uh, two years of my service was at 8th and i in washington dc while i was there i deployed to southwest asia during desert shield and desert storm um, since I've been out, it's been two divorces, it's been three children, it's been uh, one job after another, it's, uh, it's been a roller coaster really, and uh, didn't realize I had any issues uh, until about three and a half, four years ago, and see, sought some help. Um, I didn't go to the right sources the first time, but I found the right sources, and um, came across the trail totally by accident. Decided I was going to hike and then uh, came across the warrior hike again by accident and said I want to hike with these guys. These guys are amazing. Um, we've built some great, great friendships. You know, we've had ups and downs. Literally and figuratively. Literally and figuratively, yes. Um, but all in all, you know, these, these are great people. These are amazing Americans more than anything else. And it is my pleasure to be hiking alongside and behind and, well, generally behind them. But, um, yeah, I'm, I'm the fat, slow guy, so. But um, I thank you guys again. I thank Warrior Hike. I thank uh, everybody, so thank you very much. Hi, I'm Sharon Smith. Um, my trail name is Mama Goose. And first off, I have to say that Vermont is absolutely stunning. I think all of us hikers would agree to that. I mean, it's just beautiful. Uh, coming up over Stratton Mountain today, it was just, it was unbelievable. It was gorgeous up at the fire tower there. So um, I was at Desert Storm. I was a combat medic. Yay, Desert Storm, yes. Uh, 
was a combat medic. I flew in C-130s, and I was with the 1st Marine Division on the front line and took care of those boys and girls, and then um, also Iraqi EPWs. Um, I'm now currently a physical therapist, a traveling therapist, so I can uh, work six months and take six months off to do this and be out here on this trail with these guys and girls. Um, and thank you guys all so much for dinner. I was thinking about this all day today with my 22 miles, and it was spectacular. Yeah. Thank you. Thank you. And, um, Thank you so much for all of the donations, um, for all the guys and girls who are coming home. Again, my war was a long time ago, and it's helping me tremendously being out here on the trail. But one of the main reasons why I'm out here is to help the guys and girls who are coming home now. Um, coming home damaged, to give them an opportunity to just get out into nature and use, um, use the trail, use the woods, use the camaraderie as a way of healing. Uh, I know I can speak for all of us that it's helped us all, and uh, we can only hope that it helps our brothers and sisters as they come home. So, thank you. Hi, I'm Tom Gathman, otherwise known as Jabba on the trail. I got my trail name for my love of eating lots of food, and I was slightly more rotund than the person you're seeing before you today. Uh, and it's kind of an interesting story. It keeps getting better and better with the amount of food I eat at every event. Uh, I'm still waiting on my second plate of food from somebody over there. Uh, no, I'm just kidding. <laughs> um, but uh, I just want to say, uh, first and foremost, uh, really thank you all for coming out. Um, it's a pleasure meeting a lot of you. I didn't get to meet everyone, but hopefully before I get out of here, I'll shake everyone's hand and really appreciate your, your faces here tonight. Um, I serve in the United States Marine Corps Infantry, 1st Battalion, 2nd Marine Regiment. Uh, I was in... Um, uh, Iraq twice, for fire team leader the first time, scout sniper the second time. Um, you know, I'm not sure that I had too many issues com coming out of uh, combat. I have a lot of friends that have had a lot of issues coming out, but I can promise you that the uh, you know being out there on the trail has really given me a lot of insight into some of the things that I've seen and some of the things that I've been a part of, and it's really helping me to kind of carve a path for my future and it's it's been a real pleasure to meet a lot of other hikers out here on the trail and to do it with these these fine young people here beside me and it's uh it's been one of the greatest six months of my life uh, well f four and a half so far hopefully the next month and a half is going to go along just as smoothly as the last four and a half uh, again thank you so much i really appreciate it good evening my name is uh steve clendenning uh i serve 20 years in the Marine Corps, retired infantry. Um, I'm from Kokomo, Indiana. I currently reside in Jacksonville, North Carolina, home of Camp Lejeune for any of you jarheads out there. Um, I only managed uh, one combat deployment. I was wounded in Fallujah, uh, Iraq in 2006. I think I'm, I'm the only Purple Heart recipient. Um, I've been planning this trip uh, for probably the last five years and accidentally stumbled across Sean and Mark on the internet and uh, the rest has been history. Eight pair of shoes later and... It's not uh, normal by the way. It's not. It's not. But I have women's feet and I get blisters really bad. <laughs> Uh, just uh, want to say thanks for the dinner, uh, thanks for coming out, thanks for having us, and thanks for drinking with us. <laughs> Alright, uh, my name is Stephanie Cuts. my trail name is Rosie, and that comes from Rosie the Riveter, as I was a mechanic in the service, as well as a mechanic in my home life now. I got out in 2008. Um, I was in the Navy for six years, and uh, <laughs> and, uh, deployed twice in uh, 2004 and 2006 to Southeast Asia as well as the uh, Persian Gulf. And a lot of the problems that we find is when you get out of the service, you no longer have the camaraderie and the brotherhood or sisterhood, whatever you want to call it. And so, you know, the support that you're used to having.
And so coming out here, you find it again. You know, we have our, our family back here, our fellow hikers, that, you know, they come and support us as well, and we're, they're doing the same things we are doing as well. And so you make your own family. Mm -hmm. That's right. Love ya! Keep watching our crazy photos, and we have videos now that from our halfway videos, and you know we'll have videos when we finish, and we'll be sure to keep you guys in our prayers. And thank you for blessing us. You're right. Good evening. I'm Rob Carmel. My trail name is Rob. Uh, not because I didn't need a trail name. Uh, it's just because I was in the Army for 32 years. I was, I was called Private, Specialist, Sergeant, First Sergeant, Sergeant Major, and I just retired about a month and a half ago, so it's time to call me Rob. Uh, been a field artilleryman, live up in Olympia, Washington currently. Um, I always wanted to hike the Appalachian Trail. I would hike uh, weekend hikes, day hikes, uh, along the trail up in the mountains of Maryland where I grew up. And that's when I decided that someday I'll be able to hike the whole trail. So once I got finished with high school and joined the Army the same year, 32 year, years later, I finally had six months I could hike the whole trail. So. It's my opportunity. I'm glad that uh, I joined up with Warrior Hike. I didn't find out about Warrior Hike until about two weeks before I was going to start the trail anyway. So I left all my gear that I had there and came down here and got all my gear in Georgia from Warrior Hike and just took off going. It's been an awesome experience. Uh, I am so glad that I, that I got a chance to meet all the, the VFWs, Marine Corps Leagues, American Legions, uh, and it's just been such a great experience and, I, and I, any veteran would be proud to be here tonight just to see these fine faces and, and this turnout. Four face. <laughs>